Fresh color that daddy no party You alone have the style the daddy Dance hall Reggae's rebellious cousin received international acclaim thanks to the Canadian TV talent show So You Think You Can Dance. Canadian-born dancehall expert Jay Blaze choreographed a segment for the program. Blaze says it's not an easy dance form to master. The power, the beauty, the, the attitude of it, it's really hard to teach someone that. It's not a standard form of dance. It's not something where I could teach you in an eight count. Nonetheless, the international dance hall following is undeniable. This music and dance form take over dance halls around the world, from Jamaica to Japan. Blaze says that dance halls worldwide appeal is owed to their imaginative dance moves and the unique way the body moves. Your hip could be going to the right and your upper body could be going to the left. We primarily use our core and our thighs. It's very heavily influenced by African dance. There's a flow that goes, travels from the back up to the neck and then down through the chest and it's just like a circle. Our shoulders are down, we're hunched low. That's what makes dance hall different. New York-based international dance hall performer Skerritt is from Antigua. He believes social media broadens dance hall's appeal because fans across the globe can contribute in real time. Before it was everything came out of Jamaica, it had to come out of Jamaica or it wouldn't be real, it wouldn't be original, you know. But right now, through the internet, through MySpace, Facebook, Twitter, especially YouTube, it's like everyone has developed their own style. Which has provided dance hall performers like Skerritt a way to escape from poverty an opportunity to travel and help his family, which includes 16 brothers and sisters. When you get home, you can really take care of the people in your community. It's so rough seeing people that you grew up with fighting for food, fighting for clothing. Blaze and Scared feel the Jamaican dancehall culture hasn't gotten credit for its innovations. And now, mainstream rap and R&B artists are beginning to add elements of dancehall to their performances. Usher, who came out with the thunderclap, you know, then there was uh, Fat Joe with the whole lean back. All these are Jamaican dances. With the passion and creativity associated with Jamaican dances, it will likely continue to influence the mainstream. I used to say CNN Atlanta.